This is the Arena 4 best deck to use in the Arena Challenge, guys. We're going to go through from Arena 1 all the way to Arena 15, and this is the Arena 4 episode. If you want to stay tuned, subscribe down below. Make sure to keep watching because we're going all the way to the Arena 15 so you can get this epic Rocket emote. But let's get into the deck here. It's going to be a Pekka Valkyrie Goblin Barrel deck with the minions, with the Goblin Barrel, or sorry, yeah, Goblin Barrel, Skeleton Army, and Spear, guys. This is an epic deck because not only is it Barbarian Barrel bait, it's also Arrows bait. You have the minions in order to bait out arrows. You have the pack in order to defend massive giants like that you have the arrows and a fireball to support your pushes and kill stuff like that the skeleton army is going to be awesome on defense and we're getting right into this thing guys and if you've been watching the channel for a while i do really appreciate it um but if you didn't know we are not able to obviously battle anyone in arena 4 this is simply just us hoping that people have easy decks for arena 4 deck because th i mean they could have a mega knight they could have a million things here um night witch sorry mother witch gonna come down though wow that's really interesting. Let's go with the Valkyrie in the back. I'm hoping he has Mega Knight, actually. He very well might because of that Mother Witch. I'm interested to see what he's got. The Goblin Cage coming down. Let's just let our Valkyrie walk up here, do some good work, and let's go with the Peck in the back. I'm down for this. Uh, maybe we should have played a little bit slower here, but I do wonder, what has he got in store, right? Because the Archer Queen comes down. This is looking like a pretty good player, actually. Um, I'm wondering what else he's got. The Peck is moving up. I do want to Fireball this, but we're going to be uh, pretty hesitant here. We really have to find out what else he's got in store so let's go with the skeleton army here i just want to see genuinely like what he's got we're gonna bait out some sort of spell and now we're able to go with the minions and all of this and just surprise him here he went with the nato he's going with the dark prince and now he has nothing left in order to kill all of our stuff guys this will be some phenomenal damage we're gonna go for the fireball we really need to stop the bleeding though all right we catch a good fireball but pretty much the entire tower falls this deck is absolutely nuts and i'm not saying that just because it's the only, uh, my own deck, you know, I made it. This deck is genuinely insane. You saw there exactly how you want to play this deck. Even if we lose this match, I'm leaving it in the video because I, I'm leaving all of these matches in the video because, guys, that was crazy. It's just a phenomenal example of exactly the bait that this deck has. We baited out the NATO and then we punished him so hard with the uh, minions, spear gobs, and goblin whale. There's simply way too much bait for him to keep track of. We're going against the electro giant as well, by the way. I mean, we are absolutely chilling here. Let's go ahead, go with a valkyrie right here and then we'll also go ahead and spear gobs he's going to try and kill our pekka while the electro giant's coming in and it's just not going to work out for him we're going to go with our minions he's probably going to nato or if he doesn't nato we're definitely going to be able to goblin rail right here i don't think there's a single way this guy is going to be able to defend this in like any world guys there is no shot he's going to go with the skeletons here we're going to go with the goblin rail he's going to probably mother witch this um but we can fireball her but no, I mean, the Dark Prince comes down. That's well played, guys. You can't knock him on that. Let's go with the Skeleton Army here. We're going to save our pack up for that Electro Giant pretty much at all costs. Um, but let's see. We see the Mother Witch. We're going to take that Fireball all day, every day. We're going to immediately go with our Spear Gobs to hope they get some chip damage off. He's going with the Archer Queen, but we do get some nice chip damage there. That is awesome. We will certainly take that. Um, the Archer Queen's going to hopefully get overrun by this Valkyrie. Let's go ahead and Arrows, just to cycle. And the Valkyrie does get a swing off. Nice. Let's go with the Skeleton Army. I'm wondering when he's going to go with that Electro Giant. Maybe soon. Um, let's go with the Valkyrie, though. Let's go ahead and potentially cycle a Fireball, which we will definitely do. Mother Witch comes down, though. This could get a little gnarly here. This could get a little crazy. Let's go ahead and go with our Pekka, guys. Just to tank for this Dark Prince. We see the Electro Giant. I mean, there's no way this breaks through, right? There is zero shot. Let's go with the Skeleton Army literally on top of the Electro Giant. We just have to stop this and Fireball. That is all that needs to happen. He's going to Lightning, which is a really good play. But once again, all we have to do is Fireball here, guys. That will be game over. It was a close one. But an Arena 4 deck coming out on top. That is what we love to see. Deck number one, match number one, guys. It's the only deck today. But the match number one, it's a banger match. And that was a good player as well. Um, but we were able to take him down there. Like I said, I mean, the bait factor in this deck it's nuts it is so much fun and you're gonna have absolutely no problems here with this arena for banger so good luck oh one oh one i'm w interested to see what you got in store and what we'll do here is we will go with some spear gobs at the bridge it's aggressive it's pretty good play um but he's going with that wow let's go with our minions we're gonna want to take this down um the spawners not something you're gonna really see i would say but the minions hopefully can do a good da amount of damage to this, right? Nice. They'll take it down a little bit. Let's just arrows. I do want to try and just kill it. Um, so the spear gobs pop out. Let's go with a goblin barrel here. I'm interested to see what he's got in terms of answers for that. We see a spawner again, though. This is going to be rough, dude. This is going to be quite rough. We do miss the Mother Witch as well. This is not a good start. And honestly, we can still come back from it, but I'm not feeling this matchup. <laughs> the fact that he's got two spawners is really annoying. Um, let's go ahead and just Valkyrie this then. Let's try our best with Valkyrie there. Um, I mean, I don't know how we're going to break through, right? It's going to be really difficult. Um, we can do it, I guess. There's the champ. 
Let's go ahead and P.E.K.K.A. Holy smokes! The P.E.K.K.A. needed to come down a lot faster there. Um, we do have a P.E.K.K.A. down at least, right? But holy crap. I did not expect that ability to come out so fast. Um, so is he going to use a spell here? Come on. Use it. Use it. Use it. Use it. Use it. Use it, sir. We're going to Goblin Barrel. No way. No way. He's forced to go with that. This is so good for us, guys. The bait, once again, allowing us to come out on top here in the early parts of this game here. Guys, we take the whole tower down. That is so... This deck... Uh, should people the best should the best players in the world be using it? I mean, maybe maybe dude uh, He's gonna have to go with a spawner in the really far back unless he wants me to just Valkyrie it or something He's gonna a uh, dude. We'll take that Valkyrie value a uh, Valkyrie taking down a whole furnace there That's amazing. We'll take that down all day guys, and that's so free um, I'm wondering if he's gonna go with the goblin one now. Yep. There's the goblin one um, Let's go ahead and just split up a skeleton army if he goes with the mother witch here We're gonna need to fireball instantly. Come on. Where is she? Where is she? Where is she? Um all right, let's go ahead, save onto our fireball for right there. Um, we'll be able to take that down. Boom! Excellent fireball there, guys. Excellent. Let's go ahead and go with the pack in the back, though. I'm really interested to see if he'll be able to break through. If we can just defend, of course, we'll win game. Um, I don't know if we'll be able to do that, though. Let's go ahead and Valkyrie this. We'll take that all down. Um, what we'll do here, though, is we're going to go with a skeleton army and minions. A massive ambush! But he's going to play some other witch into it! Holy crap, dude! A lot's happening, and that could have been very... That, that's very bad. That is very bad, dude. Oh my gosh. The Mother Witch value, baby. Let's go with the Valkyrie here, or else we're literally gonna get, like, three crowned. Um, I didn't expect it, guys. I did not expect it. Alright, pack is going in, though. We're gonna go with another pack in the back. Oh, this is such an obnoxious deck we're facing right here. Very obnoxious. You're not gonna see Mother Witches, guys. You're not gonna see them. Let's go ahead and Minions and Skeleton Army that... We'll try and take stuff down. Oh, this is painful. It's painful, dude. We're actually about to lose. Um, That's okay. Pekka should put in some good value here. Let's go with the arrows. We'll take down those zappies quite a bit. Oh, we tried. We did try. Oh, the bandit connects. That's game. I mean, he did have kind of a counter to us. Not going to lie. But the fact that we were able to take a tower is pretty cool. That one interaction was a really good one. Let's go ahead and play one more. End it off on a win. And even though we weren't able to win that, guys, it still shows. I mean, that one interaction where we baited out all the spells, there was genuinely nothing he could do with the pack of Goblin Bale and spam behind it. It was really good there. So let's go ahead and split up some spear gobs here. I'm interested to see what he's got. QL. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Um, Sparky coming down. Let's go with the Goblin Bale here. Sparky's interesting. I have not seen a Sparky yet today, but we do end up seeing one this match, guys. That's going to be a good amount of damage there on that left side tower. Let's go ahead and split up some minions. Let's go ahead and go with our Valkyrie here. We're going to try and, of course, just defend this Dark Prince to start. Hopefully, the minions can take that down. Let's go ahead and Fireball right there. We'll go ahead and take down that Mother Witch easily. We're going to go with our Spear Gobs around that Sparky. So, the Sparky's kind of screwed. And that minion and Valkyrie over there on the right side, don't sleep on him, guys. Look at that damage coming through over a thousand damage going down right there that's phenomenal pretty much um let's go ahead and see if we can goblin wield this i'm wondering if he doesn't have too many answers here but the mother witch sparky probably means a goblin giant deck and there he is dude let's go ahead go with our pekka this is going to be intense because i mean he's got the uh, mother witch once again pretty rough that we see two mother witches as soon as we use this deck right but we'll go ahead and try our best with it let's see what this pekka can do Let's go ahead and go with the Skeleton Army and Minions. We're going to try our best to kill as much of this Sparky as possible. The Zap Spell does come down, and unfortunately that will connect. This is just rough, guys, all around. Walk away from the tower, please. Thank you very much. Um, let's go. Sparky got some good value there for him, guys. We can't lie. Sparky got some really good value for him there. Um, I'm wondering, so if we go Valkyrie here, let's go ahead and Goblin Bail this, and I'm hoping he's going to Mother Witch. Let's do this, and then we'll Fireball his Mother Witch. Prediction Fireball. Do we get her? Nope, but we do get a lot of damage from it, though. That was awesome for us. He's going to definitely push up, though, with the Goblin Giant right here, probably. Um, I wouldn't be surprised, at least. I'm wondering if we screwed up. All right, we definitely screwed up. Let's go ahead and go with the P.E.K.K.A., though. Can we stop this? I don't think we will. No, we definitely cannot. We definitely cannot. Let's see if we can counter push, though. Nope. Oh, my gosh. He's got answers, dude. This is, once again, just a really rough one for us here. Um, can we turn this around? Probably not. Probably not, dude. That's unfortunate. Okay, let's see what we can do, though. Let's push. Let's push. We know he's got that Mother Witch in here, guys. He's going to zap that. Now we go with the Goblin Barrel. Um, Goblin Barrel's going to get some good value there. It's not going to take Tower, unfortunately, though. Let's go with the Minions here. We're going to definitely be able to Fireball. Oh, my gosh. 
Let's just fireball it. I think we have to fireball that. Oh, no. This is over. There's nothing we can do, guys. Dang it, man. We almost broke through, though. We did almost break through, um, but that's not going to happen. I mean, it's just impossible there. But game number one, it was an absolute fire game. You're able to see how strong this deck is. And even though we lost, right, it doesn't mean it's a bad deck. It simply means, right, for Arena 4, you're not going to see these cards that we're going against. And that is why this deck is not top in the world, right? There was nothing we could do. Overall, the deck will crush you in Arena 4. And I do hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Deck link will be down below. And stay tuned for more because, like I said, we're going to Arena 15 all the way. A video for every arena, guys. Thank you so much for watching today's video. Have a fantastic day, everybody. Master Diddy San, out.